What's up, you guys? I am so excited for today's video. How are you guys doing this week? Um, are you are we all kind of like a little crazy this week, or is it just me? Like this week's been a little bit harder than others, but nothing a little retail therapy can't fix, right? So for today's video, I know most of us have been working out from home. Our gyms are closed. The gym I work out at has been closed for like almost two months now. So we're on the struggle bus a little bit. Supposedly I'm supposed to be going back to work on the 16th, but um, I don't know. I don't know how that's gonna work. Um, I'd be really interested to see down in the comments like where you're from and what they're doing to reopen because I know a lot of places are still like on full lockdown, but Places are starting to open up for us and it's weird. Anyways, I've been doing a lot of online shopping, a lot of online shopping. I feel like every single day I end up with a package and holy moly, it's like when <laughs> Joe Exotic's like, I'm never gonna financially recover from this. That's how I feel about this quarantine because I've been doing so much shopping. But yeah, I have been working out from home before I got my job as a personal trainer. Um, i had been working out at home for almost a year and a half, almost two years-ish. Uh, so I have my own little setup out here in the garage, but I know a lot of you guys don't have that. So I want to give you the essentials, or at least that I find are like must-haves, uh, if you're going to be working out from home. So let's jump into it. probably like the most important part if you're gonna be working out from home sometimes it can be really really hard to just get off the couch and like get your body moving so you need some pre-workout got mine here I feel like I need some ice in it so I can do my little shaky thing with you know I feel like you just need pre-workout like just to get some energy to get going you know um, by the way everything that I mentioned in this video it's going to be linked down below. I didn't get it from Amazon. I will link like a dupe or something that's very, very similar. So my favorite pre-workout, it's lemon flavored. I love it. Um, it's the only pre-workout that I've drank that doesn't make me feel like super, super jittery. Like if I have a monster or any other type of energy drink, I'm like, whoa. So yeah, I need, I need this in my life and I think you need it too. And I just recently bought this. I wasn't sure how I would feel about it because it's a stimulant-free pre-workout. It is, from Alani New, it's Pump Stimulus Free Mango Sorbet. It's for endurance, focus, and pump. So basically the same thing as a pre-workout, just without the caffeine. When I take this, I do not feel the same benefits as this. And I think that's probably the point of it but I would not just drink this by itself for a workout if I was feeling tired and like I needed the boost that this gives me. This, I honestly just love it because um, if I'm doing like a leg day or a booty day and I drink this afterwards, my butt looks so amazing. Okay, it's like your muscles, like yesterday I was doing biceps and my biceps were like, bam, afterwards. So that's like before your workout. For like your actual workouts that you're doing at home, my number one thing that I would recommend to you guys, if nothing else for your little at home gym storage, get yourself some resistance loops. And not just any re resistance loops, because I have some up there on my wall that I bought from Amazon that were trash. They were trash. And I'm so used to these, so resistant. And when I used those up there, I was like, this isn't working me at all. So get yourself some good resistance bands. Again, I will link these down below. Um, they come in a pack of three. So like the heavy resistance, the medium, and then the yellow, which I just could not find. Um, yeah, I just couldn't find it. <laughs> Cause I never used the light resistance one. I just mainly use these two. So if you don't have weights at home, resistance loops are a really really great alternative because not only can you do um, leg and booty exercises that's what I use them for mainly but you can do so many different exercises with them as well if anything 
get yourself some resistance loops. I will link these ones down below. I'm sure you can find good ones on Amazon too, but the ones that I've bought just aren't resistant enough and they don't work. And I feel like every time I put them on, they're gonna just rip. These I've had for two years, not a single rip. They are still so resistant. Yeah, I just think they're really, really great. It kind of moves us on to this little bad boy. Um, again, kind of a must have, just like makes things so much easier if you don't have dumbbells. I did get this off Amazon, I will link it for you. It is Rit Fit, and this is the 15, 10 to 15 pound one, the pink, but they have other ones too that are more resistance or less resistance. I just thought this was a good medium one, and I was honestly just trying to try it out, but it's been a staple piece in this little gym I have of mine. So. Though that is the equipment that like, oh, and then these core sliders too. I got these in a FabFitFun box. They are the uh, Brooke Burke ones. I have some other ones too, but they don't work as well on this flooring that I have. So I will try to find some that have really good reviews on Amazon that are these, because or maybe I will be able to find these, but just for different core exercises, you can um, do some leg exercises with them too. I've just, they're so versatile. These three things, honestly, so key. Like if you're not going to use weights and um, you're wanting to do this on a budget, like all of this stuff together would be less than like $30. So super, super cheap, super versatile, and we'll get the job done. Now, if you're wanting to amp it up a little bit, and I would say this is a must have just because it's so good for your body, but like it's not an essential like you could do this with you could massage yourself with your hands and stuff but this foam roller here i got this from target it is the tone it up one it's that foam roller you know what i mean sometimes your muscles are so so sore and you just need to roll you know you know roll it out you know so this is the one i have um i can try to find another one too maybe cheap on amazon um yeah roll it out Another thing that I think is like an essential if, if you do wanna have like your own little makeshift space, these foam blocks that I have underneath me that I'm sitting on, not my yoga mat, cause I don't think it's cushiony enough. Um, but I just think having a foam, like these, either these foam pieces or um, gorilla mats, but those are expensive. These foam pieces that I have, I was given them, like they were given to me, but um, I know that they were from Amazon. You can buy them either like in bulk or you can just buy a couple of them. And um, they're really great to just like piece together really fast. And then if you wanted to put them away, like say you had it out in your room and you were working out in your bedroom and you didn't want it out all the time, they're super easy just to like, they're like puzzle pieces. So you put them in and then you take them out and super easy just to store maybe like your closet or something i do think that is something like if you want your own space like if you have hardwood floors especially they just make things comfier and cushier and so it's not so hard on your body because working out on hardwood floor can be really i used to do that in my bedroom all the time and it's not fun <laughs> here's where i get really excited and i want to get a little like speaker for out here for just like being in the gym or if I was going for a run, even out here, they work perfectly, or my AirPods. I did get this cute little case. A lot of people ask me where this case is from. It's from Amazon, I'm gonna link it down below. Um, it's a little avocado, it's so cute. Anyways, um, yeah, just because I have to have, I have to have music. The next thing is not really fitness related, but I thought I had to throw in my favorite quarantine essential. I'll look and see if this is on Amazon, if you can get this off Amazon. Um, I just got a little sample of it, but it's lasting me forever. But it is the Origins Ginseng SPF 40 Energy Boosting Tinted Moisturizer. I have not, like I'm not wearing foundation right now. I have not worn foundation since the start of quarantine. I refuse. I will put some makeup on, but no, but I like this. It's just a really light coverage, but this is something that just gives you that little tint of like, it kind of like just blurs your imperfections a little bit, but isn't heavy like foundation is. And it's an SPF 40, so you gotta wear sunscreen, obviously. I always wear sunscreen on my face. Um, 
but this has been like quarantine must have have to have it okay if you just saw that i'm gonna insert that in just so everybody knows i'm recording these videos on my iphone okay I really need to get a camera, but that's gonna be like my gift to myself. I can't just out and out like buy a camera, but I need to. I'm probably like a different tripod. <sighs> Anyways, wow. Okay, the last thing they have for you, again, you're like, Ugh, this is not fitness related, but it is because remember my last video how I talked about um, how your well-being and your physical health like go hand in hand. So something that I think is just super important to do anytime, but especially like during quarantine and everything that's going on. Um, and it goes like I either like to do it right after my workout, right before to kind of mix it in that, or first thing in the morning. And it is my gratitude journal. Good day start with gratitude because you're looking for the good. Like when you force yourself to focus on the good throughout the day, even if there are things that suck or that uh, maybe the media is just really depressing and you know, you're in kind of a weird spot because everybody's in a weird spot right now. Just forcing yourself to focus on the good forces your brain to like look for good throughout the day. Sounds super weird, but I guarantee you like it's a thing. And I just love this journal because, I mean, honestly, you can just use any journal, but I just love this one because it's super, super simple. Every week there's a quote, and then you write three things that you're thankful for every single day. I just love this. It's super simple um, and cute on the outside. I don't know. But I just think that it's so important to focus on the good every single day. And this basically forces you to do that. These, again, are my staples, the favorites that I have not just during quarantine, but um, just in general working out from home. They just make it so much easier. And most of them are pretty affordable, so you don't need to spend a lot of money to get an effective workout. In. So if you liked the things in this video, if you found something that you're like, oh my gosh, I wanna try that, or um, you just like listening to me talk, <laughs> make sure that you like this video, and then go ahead and subscribe so that you don't miss out on my next videos. And with that, I will see you guys next time.